Helping news right now, the state parole board is considering whether or not to grant release to a convicted killer. We spoke to the victim's family last month, and this morning we caught up with them again as they argued that James Hughes should stay behind bars. Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Scherer is live at the ACI in Cranston with the developing details. A life sentence without parole was not an option when Jamie Hughes was convicted of murder in 1983, so every few years he comes up for parole. This morning, a hearing was held. Early Monday morning, the family of murder victim Howard Zeke Harris went before the parole board to ask that they keep Jamie Hughes in prison for killing Harris. I hope that the parole board listened to us. Um, we made it very, very clear that this man would not be um, good in the society, um, in the community. Um, around elderly people. Hughes is currently in a Concord mass prison serving time for the brutal killing of the 79-year-old Davisville furniture dealer back in 1982. Hughes was found guilty of beating the Sunday school teacher to death with a hammer and now once again is up for parole. Normally um, we would come before the parole board every five years. This time it was only three years so we're concerned that they're considering paroling him. According to our news partner, the Providence Journal, Hughes' family defends the inmate, saying he used heroin and other drugs, but maintain he did not kill Harris. They say he has changed his life while in prison by earning a degree, and they hope he is set free. He committed a very, very heinous murder. He beat my grandfather in the head for just a few dollars. I don't know how he can be rehabilitated. The Harris family tells Eyewitness News that they learned just today that Hughes was transferred back to Rhode Island's ACI last week. Now, we are told the parole board is expected to make a decision later today on whether or not to grant Hughes parole. Reporting live with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Marilyn Shera, Eyewitness News.